Good morning, everyone. This is Jim Johnson, and for the last uh, ten and a half years, I've had the privilege of being the president and CEO at Tripwire, and we're here today to talk about some very exciting news. If I was trying to summarize all of this, is actually the way I did summarize it when we announced it to our 450 employees. It was no change, and let me explain that as we go through uh, this very exciting news. Uh, this week we announced that uh, Belden Corporation was going to acquire uh, Tripwire. We expect the transaction to actually close uh, very early in Q1. And from all of your perspectives, the first thing I would like to say is I would like to thank you for the, your business and for your trust and faith in us. And I would be able to say now with a total um, from the heart that that trust and faith, uh, everything that you did, you had in us, will continue. Uh, Belden is a perfect fit for Tripwire. It's a perfect fit because we both have an intense focus on supporting you, our customers. Our cultures are very, very similar. We're very results oriented. Uh, we're very focused on delivering quality support to our customers. And there's a very strong focus on technology. We are inherently a technology company. And so it really is a perfect match for us. Mm -hmm. So one thing that we're going to do is flip to slide one or two, I should say. We'll then actually go right ahead to slide three. I think Chad will help me out here a little bit. And who is Belden? Actually, Belden is a leader in the industrial uh, market. They focus on what we would call OT, or operational technology. They're very focused on delivering to uh, their customers our factory floors, our major utilities. Uh, ma matter of fact, the way we began to work with Belden was uh, we currently support nine out of the ten top utilities in the United States, uh, helping them to become compliant with NERC, and it was there that we began to work together in solving some fairly important strategic problems for our customers. And we began to realize that securing the operational side of things, the challenges are very similar to securing the um, IT side of things. So we began to work more and more together solving those problems in, uh, our, in the utility space and in the industrial space, and we discovered that there was a lot of synergy between the two. If we go ahead uh, to slide four, you know, again, the very fundamental thing that was in their strategic plan and certainly was in our strategic plan is as the Internet begins to proliferate, and we talk a lot certainly uh, in, the, uh, in the Valley about the Internet of Things and how that that's going to explode. But one of the critical elements that it has to be tackled as we begin to uh, expand beyond uh, where we are today is security. So just connecting everything is an important uh, element, but securely connecting everything is even more critical. And we believe that the same kinds of problems it's going to take to solve the what we would call the enterprise of things, which is what we're focused on, and Belden is certainly uh, focused on the uh, operational side or the industrial, um, you know, Internet of Things. That that's both those steps are required as we move to really solving the Internet of Things. So now let me go ahead and uh, move on to uh, slide five. And for here, it really is the impact of this acquisition uh, to you again is really no change. There's actually a little bit of change, and it's actually quite positive change, and I'll get into that in just a moment. But again, Belden values uh, you know, technology. They value moving this thing forward, and as we began to share our strategic vision of where we're taking Tripwire and theirs, they were very, very intrigued and very, very um, interested in how we are evolving our next generation product. So one of the other things that was very important to me was I wanted to make sure that in this acquisition that when we would come out, we would come out stronger, stronger to be able to support you, our customers, 
and stronger as a company. And you know, I'm sure many of you have experienced acquisitions where great security companies got folded into very large corporations. And you know, the the energy and the creativity and the innovation began to slowly die out. And that was not an acceptable outcome for me. I think that as we look towards uh, the next generation security companies and supporting uh, uh, this much broader challenge that we have, it's going to take very nimble, very focused, very innovative companies to solve it. Companies that really focus on what they do best and then work very closely with the, uh, the ecosystem in the, uh, that many of you have put together to be able to solve these big problems. So the operating uh, culture that we have here in our new ownership is one that will take, and as, as John Stroop, who is the CEO of Belden said, we buy great companies, we let them run autonomously so that they continue to be great. And so we will be a standalone uh, entity. Actually, legally, we're exactly the same entity, so all of our contracts with all of you, uh, uh, there's no change required for that. For, for in the future, if you ever have to renegotiate contracts, you'll be doing it with the same uh, team that you've done it with in the past, and we have all the authority to do everything we need right here at Tripwire. Strategically, the second reason that I think Belden bought us is that they want to take our technology, which is, in my opinion and, and in theirs, world class, and begin to move that and embed it into the industrial side. And again, as many of you know who have to deal with the operational technology side of things, the, those customers and how they buy and, and the values that they require are different than on the commercial side. So our job is to really take our technology, embed it into Belden's solutions, and then through Belden's normal way of, of connecting with their customers and supporting their customers, they will take care of it on that side. That frees us to continue to fo focus where we are on the commercial and on the government spaces. The other element that was very important to me is there's no change to the trip Tripwire team. Tripwire itself will continue as an entity, our brand will continue as an entity, and really from your point of view, in many cases, just no change. So if we go ahead on to slide six, from your specific point of view, again, I'll say no change, no change, no change. And, and you know, uh, you can read some of these things here, but I will say there is one change that you will feel. And that's one that I'm very, very excited about. And it's, be, and it's that Belden, as we were, you know, the timing of this is the end of the year. I know all of you are going through your plan 2015, you know, processes as, just as we were. And we had developed our 2015 plan. And as Belden reviewed that 2015 plan, they said, Jim, we are so excited about your, your next generation of innovation that you're going to be delivering to your customers and then ultimately to Belden's customers through their channels. They said, we want to accelerate that. So we actually went, we already had the largest R&D you know, spend in our company history uh, on the books. They said, make it even bigger. So we will be investing the largest amount of money in R&D that we ever have in the company history, and the largest is a percentage of our revenue. Again, with the goal of accelerating that next generation of innovation that we'll be delivering to you. So if I was to try to summarize all of this again from your perspective, the same team that's been supporting you will continue to support you. Whether it's in the sales, whether it's in the support team, whether it's in our ad administrative side, it really doesn't matter because all 450 of our employees will continue to be employed by Tripwire. And as I mentioned, we have a very aggressive plan for 2015 and will be continuing to expand. So what this does is it adds a little more certainty to our future. You know, we were owned by Tomo Bravo, which I have great respect for as a, uh, as a, uh, a PE firm, but ultimately we were going to get sold. And so now we have been sold, and, we're, and again, we've been sold to Belden, which is a perfect fit. It allows us to continue to support you in the way we have in the past and actually even accelerate some of that innovation and we are given the autonomy it takes so that we can continue to be agile and we continue to be hyper-focused on solving your problems. 
So that really is a summary of uh, where we are. And at this point, you know, if there's any questions, I'd be uh, happy to answer those. And I can see there aren't any. And actually, again, from when we talked to our employees, it was a very similar situation. Because the, the basic answer is always going to be no change. The way it's been is the way it will continue to be. So with that, I'd like to, th again, thank you for your business. And I look forward to continuing to support you as we begin to solve the security problem and be able to deliver real confidence to both you and your businesses that you support. Again, thank you very much.